Okay, I'm on my way to the tournament. Um, kind of a habit now of me when going to tournaments, almost ceremoniously, I, um, I always pick up a five-hour energy. They do not keep me awake. That's It keeps me alert. Not awake, but alert. And it kind of staves off the hunger from not sleeping, too. So um, I would definitely consider that. And um, more advice coming up. Okay, pro tip number two. Um, if you have the opportunity to, get a good amount of sleep the day before the tournament. Um, don't kid yourself, you're not going to go to bed on time. Um, this is the earliest I have ever gone to bed before a tournament. Um, just to give you an idea, I went to bed today at 2. A typical tournament night is 5 o'clock, and then I get up at 8. So, um, definitely keep that in mind. You're not going to get sleep. Don't pretend you will. Alright, pro tip number 3. Um, bring extra crap. Just lots and lots of extra crap. I brought probably 150 dice with me. I brought two tape measures, two calculators, two different things of different kinds of glue. I brought um, my assault squad with me, even though it's not in my list, just in case. I brought um, all sorts of extra arms and that to, to change out my sergeants to different war gear options if I decide to go that route really quickly when I get there. Um, just bring lots of extra stuff. Don't ever bring just the models that um, are in your list, because you never know. Um, maybe you made an adding mistake and you, buy, and you figure it out right before you get there. You want to be able to downgrade or upgrade to fill up the points. Um, also, I've got like four copies of my list. That's minimum. Bring maybe more. Um, all sorts of stuff like that. Bring your templates. Um, just bring lots of extra crap. All right, I don't even know what tip I'm on. So the next tip, um, make sure that you are not the guy at the club who didn't fucking wear deodorant that everyone can smell from across the room. Tournaments are hot and you're standing around in one spot all day long and it's usually not cool in there. Um, and you're sweating because you're about to face some insane armies and crap like that. So just take time, get clean, and uh, it, 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 it's worth it to not be sitting there completely sweating uncomfortable. Okay, next tip. Get there early if you can. Um, you don't know if you're going to run into traffic. Um, leave early. Uh, I, like, I typically get there like an hour early and help them do finishing, touches on setting up and that kind of stuff. Today I'm running really late. But I helped them set up last night, so I'm only gonna be like I'm gonna be like 20 or 30 minutes early before like the pre-registration, before the people who haven't registered yet. And I'm already registered, so I'm still gonna be a good 30, 40 minutes early. Um, you want to be early. The last thing you want is to be running in the door last second. You're gonna make mistakes. You're gonna forget things, um, and that's not what you want at a tournament. Okay, one of my last tips because I'm almost there. Um, take your time driving. Do not run red lights. The last thing you want is for this tournament to cost you another $150. Um, if, you're, if you're okay with blowing $150 to get a, a, get a ticket for running a red light, then instead buy a Battle Force and a few box sets and send them to me because I sure will appreciate them much more than the police department will. So um, take your time. Y you're carrying precious cargo in your car. Your entire tournament army, most likely the best models, um, all completely assembled, com you know, all of the weapons accurately represented, and possibly all painted. Um, take your time. The last thing you want is to get rear-ended and have all of your guys in the trunk be smashed into tiny pieces on your way to a tournament. So, um, don't let people intimidate you as this taxi driver is doing to me right now. Um, take your time. They can go around, they can piss off, they don't have thousand five hundred dollars worth of models in their trunk. Massacre Resolve wouldn't be there if they didn't want you to use it. Um, if you can massacre someone, if you can table an opponent, go right ahead. Um, it's a tournament. Um, you can still be friendly about it. You don't have to be like, oh look, I, to I totally just blew up your mans. What, what are you going to do about it? Don't like throw it in their face and crap. Um, just be calm, be nice, and massacre the crap out of their army. Pay special attention and detail to deployment. Deployment is 
um, probably the single easiest way to gain an advantage or cause yourself a disadvantage in the entire battle. Um, you do not want to be caught with a bad, bad deployment. Um, Chaos Bob, one of the best players we have here at the Cosmic Castle, um, every time I played against him, he's completely caught me on deployment.